America's sea power on parade. Uncle Sam's mighty armada swings into line before its commander-in-chief. President Roosevelt, with Admiral Stanley, Chief of Naval Operations, and his staff, takes the salute on the cruiser Indianapolis, which proudly flies the flag of its distinguished guest. With his cabinet, the President's official family also attends him on this great naval display. Airplane carrier Lexington, with its brood of Seahawks lined up on deck, heads the impressive show. The president is joined by Mrs. Roosevelt and his mother, and their son and daughter, Mrs. Dahl and Jane. Secretary Swanson and ex-Secretary Daniels, the President's chief when he was Assistant Secretary of the Navy, stand with them as 200 planes zoom over the reviewing ship. Salute from Governor's Island. The review over, the Armada enters the harbor of New York past the Statue of Liberty. The Indianapolis, with the President aboard, leads the fleet by the famous skyline of Manhattan into the Hudson, where it will remain for 18 days. The ship moves to its anchorage, providing New Yorkers with the most inspiring view of Uncle Sam's sea power that they've ever had. The city extends to the fleet the welcome of a proud and confident nation.